Yes, hi, this is Juan Lince, GM Lince Computers. Uh, so today I'm going to open this Asus uh, UX303L notebook PC. Um, what I'm going to do, or the reason why I'm doing this is because I'm going to replace the back cover and also probably the hinge, the hinges. And I also got this as a, as a combo package with the cover. So what happened with this laptop, I'm just going to share a little bit. Uh, and this is a common problem. Basically, this breaks like this. And some people believe that maybe by replacing just the hinge is okay, but the, the actual problem is that here uh, on the back, um, the thing that holds the screws broke. So we have to replace the whole thing. So this is what usually breaks. This is this. So these little uh, metal pieces break. So that's why the hinges are like flying around. Okay. So first things, of course, uh, turn off your computer. I'm just going to kill it. Okay. If you can just do normal shutdown is better. <coughs> okay, so oh this is a T5 that we're going to use to open this. I'm using this little kit. I'll leave a link on under the description if you wanna get it. But yeah, uh, there's a lot of devices that now uses this uh, kind of screwdriver, especially Max. So we just need to remove those those screws. All right, so basically all of these screws are the same. So you don't have to worry about which one goes where. This is the only one that's longer. And that one is the one that goes here in the middle. Okay. So to open up, you might need a tool like this, just to find like a, a gap. So once you find it, then very gently and be patient just go ahead and loose up the okay there's a little hard so if it's hard maybe here maybe there's also a screw so i'm going to check right now Yep, we got two more screws right here. This is a regular Phillips. Okay. So always when opening a computer, if 
you feel some resistance never try to force it out because maybe there's just a missing screw okay so we got two let's try it again yeah this ones you don't worry about it there's no screws there and that's it we were able to open it <coughs> So you just want to replace the hard drive here's the hard drive just take uh, on a screw this and here also and you you'll be able to just free up the hard drive or this is the battery also it's easy to replace just one two screws here another one here and another one here and another one there and that, that's the connector in this case i'm going to be working on loosening up the hinges first and there's also the the connectors for the wi-fi and the connector for the video card so for the video card i mean for the video display you just do this you see there's one screw here This is for the hinge. And this two right here. I'll be removing this yellow tape because we need to unscrew this. Usually there's no problem removing the, the cables for the for the wireless but um, you still try to be careful uh, I will just pull it like from the a little behind like this you don't want to break the connector sometimes here they are delicate like in the base or even once uh, I had a problem with one of those little guys that just were I guess too delicate so yeah just remove it like that carefully try to use a tool for that instead of just your fingers okay so this one is broken so this one we just lift it a little bit okay so we can safely remove the bottom part of the laptop so now uh, I'll have to work on transplanting the LCD into the new uh, back cover <laughs> 